Hey guys, my name is Ismas and welcome to Top Channel 101. So there is a new tool in town called Plasticity and in a lot of ways is similar and different to Blender. It is similar in that they almost copying the entire workflow of Blender, the way it works, the keystrokes and uh, shortcuts that Blender uses and, and they're using it here, which is amazing because that means that uh, you don't have to relearn a new program from scratch. You can transfer some of the, the knowledge used in Blender into this plasticity application. The difference is that uh, it's a NURBS best tool. So it doesn't use polygon modeling like Blender. Uh, it just uses NURBS. Blender has a NURBS option, but uh, the NURBS modeling tools in Blender are, are quite limited compared to this. This is a full standalone application that is geared towards to NURBS modeling, similar like uh, Sharp, Sharp 3D or any other application in that category. So I'm just going to jump in here and I uh, just show you how similar it is. Uh, you can see when you open it up, you start with the default cube and uh, the interface also is similar. If you hold down your middle mouse wheel, you orbit around uh, your scene. If you hit seven, you will look at the top and then one from the front three from the right. You can see the interface is entirely similar to Blender. They also have their uh, polygon selection tools. I said this wasn't polygon modeling, but uh, yeah, you, you can still select edges, uh, faces and uh, or an entire object. So yeah, it does use a lot of booleans. Uh, so for example, if I wanted to add a boolean card on this, I'll just uh, add select a sphere here, draw that sphere. And to confirm, I just have to right click and that will be added. You have your navigate your move tools, move, rotate and scale tools here. So just move this anywhere that I want, maybe scale it down. You can see even the gizmo looks identical to the Blender version. S is for scale, R is for rotate and G is for move exactly like how Blender works. So let me scale this down a bit like this. You have something similar to the outliner here. I just select this and I then select the Boolean option, which is here and just select the object I want to cut out and I hit OK. And you can see now I have a Boolean cut out like that, which I think is super amazing. So I can come into face mode here and even select the faces that I want. If I want to offset this, I can just scale it up and down like that. There have been a lot of artists who have jumped in into this. I'm going to be showing some of the their works here. This is a very, very powerful tool and uh, it's quite precise uh, compared to Blender because uh, it's, it's geared towards card artists. You can bevel the face or edge like that. And uh, there are also tools that can help you link your objects directly into Blender so that you work in this application and then your work is directly in real time linked to your blend project file and uh, then whatever you edit here can be reflected in the project file. Yeah, so if you're tired of polygon modeling and you want to give a uh, plasticity a try or nubs modeling a try, uh, I would recommend this uh, application. Uh, links are going to be in the description. I just thought you might be interested in something like this. Thank you.